until you get me to stop. <laughs> the Grinnell house sold within 24 hours of being listed. <laughs> oh. Sad. Hello everybody, it is the next day and another day, another house. <laughs> um, so we are headed out to three more houses today and as you heard, the house from yesterday already accepted an offer, so that's fun. That was kind of like our, I guess, backup house, I'd say. So that's really frustrating, and this is just how this process goes. It's really annoying and frustrating, and <laughs> so we will keep looking. Whoa, that was bumpy. And hopefully one of these three will be worth putting an offer in. I'm hopeful anyways, but I think the two we're going to see today, one is already going to be asking for highest and best tomorrow by 8 p.m., I think. And then the other, I don't know, I think is like Monday or Sunday or something like that. It's hard to remember. I don't know. They all meld together, but. Did a text message. Yeah. So we'll see how this goes. Wish us luck. just made it to house number one and I'm a little bit nervous because it's right on the back side of a busy road <laughs> so we're gonna go walk around and check her out Yeah, that one was a no-go. We didn't even finish looking at the whole house. It's right on a busy road, and it was kind of expensive for what it had to offer, which was kind of disappointing. It would have to do, we'd have to do a lot of work to update that house, and the area is not that great, so we are headed to the next one. So this one has a little community area with a fire pit. So that's kind of cool. This one is already fenced in. Can we figure out what uh, we're Another One no. <laughs> it was in such a nice area. I had such high hopes. And it's a beast. I'm so sad. Like I could literally cry. You almost did. Uh, that sucks. Maintain your houses. <laughs> Resale value. <laughs> Look at that. It's just like. Uh, she it's scratched the crap out of a wall. So disappointing. Paint it. That's listed. Don't worry, it'll be just sold. All right, babe, what did you think of that house, that last house we saw? I liked it. What did you like about it? It had a sunroom. It had a nice kitchen. It had cool functional spaces. <laughs> Our little tea kettle on the floor is making a little noise. What did you like about it? Okay, 
So it is now March, which is crazy. We have been looking for a house for, let's see, we kind of started in August. So August, September, October, November, December, January, February. So we've been looking for a house for seven months. We put in another offer on that last house I just showed you guys right before this clip. And um, we put it in at asking price with the contingency of both our um, like mortgage or financial um, information going through and then as well as the inspection. And unfortunately, we just found out that we didn't get it. Um, so this is our third offer that we didn't get. So it's kind of, I don't know, it's kind of disappointing, but I didn't want to put in anything higher than the asking price because I just feel like it was already kind of a lot for what the house offered. While it was in a really great location, I just didn't feel like it was more than what they were asking. So that's why we put it in at asking price and yeah, they just got some other offers that were either better or whatever. So unfortunately that's where we're at the search continues and yeah <laughs> more houses to come but um i hope you guys have been enjoying this journey it's been frustrating but also somewhat fun um i think at first the process was really fun but it's just become kind of frustrating that we can't really find the house that we really want and we also just have been putting in offers and nothing has been uh, working out for us so hopefully hopefully our house is going to show up soon and yeah but it gives us more time to save money which I'm super happy about so alrighty I will catch you guys in the next one